Hello everyone, welcome to Wati Tutorial. In this video today, I'm going to show you the teaming box. So first of all, for the teaming box, what it is for. So for teaming box, you can see all the message coming through your WhatsApp business number. And this is a platform that you can easily collaborate with different agents to support all the incoming chats and see the past chat history, etc. Let's take a look right here of this interface. On the left, you will see the different chat that coming through. You can filter it by active chat that is within the 24 hour session. And you can filter with all the chats that regardless of the time, so that will show all the chat, the outbound broadcast on the side of the chat, etc. That you can use it to filter the chat based on your needs. Secondly, in the central part, you will see the console that you can communicate with your client. For example, if I am um, the client right here, then I say hi, and there's like auto reply of the Wati demo, then I can also reply and take the chat from the bot. And then I can reply to the client directly. Then for the client side, they will receive the menu message that I sent out just now. Apart from message that I can send out, I can also add the attachment, emoji, or send out the quick reply that we have saved here. So how it works is that you can create a quick reply. Say welcome message by Crystal. Let's say I would like to customize a quick re reply that I always use. And I can also add an image or video. So let me add a Wati logo, for example, for this quick reply, then I can save it. And I will have a new message here. If I would like to use it, then I can click this send icon to send out to the client as well. So in the future, if I would like to use the quick reply, say if people always ask about pricing, always ask about certain product detail, then I can have this um, this um, quick reply and I can easily navigate it, search for it, and then send it to client. That will facilitate the customer support process as well. And here you will see the message that is received by the client side already. So on the right hand side, uh, you will see the detail of the client, the name, phone number, and also um, the contact attribute that we have added for this client. The tag, for example, if they have asked for um, pricing, then I can add a new tag for, for this chat as well. And that can be a note session. So that will be shareable for all the team, uh, team members. Uh, different operator right here, they will be able to see the no session as well. So say if this client, um, they have um, asked it about product A, then it can be a future reference for the agent as well. So I click tick and it will be saved here, ask about product A, and there will be a timestamp here that is added by Crystal on 7th of February. And apart from that, uh, once I would like to um, solve the chat, to mark it as soft status, I can do it right here. If the client did not have any further question, I would like to resolve it, um, everything is going good, then I can resolve the chat. And that would not be showing up in the active chat anymore because it is resolved. It. This is how you can easily use the teaming box to collaborate between different agents to support your client with quick reply and also find the client detail on the right hand side to support the client personal and the personalized method. Thank you very much for watching this video.